I don't think we need to set up our people for this. I think that the turrets should be able to do it by themselves. Let's actually just watch and watch it all happen. This guy's a smart one. He was like, yep, fuck that. I'm out of here. Everybody, welcome back. Falcon, Rimworld Alpha 7. We lost a colonist last episode. <laughs> Sorry, I'm not sure what that pause was all about. I guess I was just heartbroken. We lost Cohen Vores. Uh, unfortunately, he died of natural causes. I guess it's natural disease. Uh, the plague. He got hit with an extreme case of the plague where we couldn't even heal him. We gave him rest. We put him in different beds. Medical attention. It just unfortunately killed him. So, hey, you know, sometimes it is what it is. I apologize, my friend, but it happened to you. Now, we are building hats for the sole purpose of money. So, Brandon Edwards, I'm sorry to have to cover that sweet mohawk of yours up, but let me have you put on this fucking hat right there. Yeah. We want a colony of nothing but... Dude's wearing hats. You'll wear the squirrel squin, be arrow, named after a Pokemon. I need to rename you, by the way. Whoever gets that guy, you know, I think you're the luckiest dude of all time. Um, let's see, um, Tortoise Leatherhead, yeah. I'm done for today, go put that on. All of you guys need hats, by the way. Darkrai, Daiquiri, Yukam, and... Uh, no more hats? Oh, that's disappointing. Alrighty, don't worry. We're gonna sell, we're gonna get some more. We'll always get hats. Hats will always be part of the colony. This is a matter of waiting until they get built, though. What is this? Pistol. Pick this up. I think that was, um, Cohen Vors' pistol, as a matter of fact. You know, somebody might actually need that. So while you guys work, let me just scroll through all of you cats here. George is good. You're good. Um, Grecchio does not have a weapon, but that's because he can't fight. Darkrai has a bow. Sequence Life has a great bow. D-Money has a bow. Wolverine. Bow. Brandon Edwards has no weapon. Brandon Edwards, how do you, what do you excel at here? You're naked too, Brandon? Okay, we gotta give you some clothing, my friend. Brandon, you're actually not a bad shot. So... Brandon Edwards, let me first and foremost put some pants on you, you... You... You slut. <laughs> Get over here, put some pants on, alright? What's wrong with you? Other than that, we'll give you... There's no shirts, huh? Interesting. Alrighty, we'll just give you the uh, Devil Strand tribal wear as well. Excellent. Alright. Now... You have a hat? Or, you have a weapon now, do you? No, you don't. Brandon Edwards, come and equip this pistol. Because you're not a bad fighter, apparently. Alright, so he's good. I make sure everybody's uh, wearing clothing, by the way. They should be, but you never know. Let's go to gear here. Alright, so... Camino, well, you're... Oh, we recruited Camino! Oh, sweet! I missed it completely. Uh, Camino, you have no weapon. How are you as a fighter, my friend? Uh, shooting three, melee seven. Alright. Well, not exactly the greatest out there. But let me at least give you the tribal wear. The... Devil Strand one, and we'll give you a bow as well. Just so you have something going on. Hurry up, man. You're the slowest dude of all time. And let me give you... Ba -ba 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 -ba, a bow, I did say. There's a few extra hats here. You know what? Grab yourself a hat, too. Hats for everybody. Grecchio! Yeah, you're not... You're, you get a uh, hat, too, right? Everybody gets hats. Perfect. <clears throat> okay, so we're still waiting for a few more hats. This is the, the cowboy colony, essentially. It's like a complete space western now. <clears throat> so, uh, I want to make sure that we also have enough rooms for everybody that we do have here, right? Unknown, unowned, medical bed. Let's turn this one off. And yeah, so this could go offline now. We don't need you on anymore. Because there's nobody in there. Perfect. Alright, and this is my medical facility over here. You could be offline for now unless somebody actually needs some treatment. This is growing in pretty nicely. Alright, so... We are doing some good stuff here, and we're mining right now because we do need a bit more metal. Significantly amount of more metal, as a matter of fact. I, I expect at this point we could probably start cutting trees down again, just because we're done with the major hauling. Although, defenses still need a few more, right? <clears throat> so before we start doing that, stone blocks were at 709. I hope that we're um, still doing stone cutting, right? Yes. It's a forever task. So I guess what we can do is start you know, making this a bit more stronger here. So let's go with structure, we'll do stone conduit. So this is where one of my security turrets should be, so we'll do... this like this. I was thinking about double walling them. And I guess I could start doing that now, but... <clears throat> I don't know, I guess we'll just keep it this way and see how it happens. And then, bam. Bam. So we'll add a bit, at least three more right now. It's right here. This right here, and that right there, and then give me some security turrets, obviously. Improvised turret, bam. Bam, and bam, and finally, one, two, and three. 
I guess we gotta add four, right? I don't think we have enough for four or six, as a matter of fact, as it is. But we could put another one right here and have that shoot down there. So, yeah, might as well do that. Place you here and place you here. <clears throat> I don't think we'll have enough metal for it, so we're gonna have to continue mining in order to make that happen. Although we might, we just have to actually haul that off. Now, we need to find some more areas to mine for metal. We're gonna probably have to start sending my people out over here to actually get this done. Which is alright, but at the same time, I hate having to move them too far off. This is gold ore, and what is this one? Silver ore. Ooh. Okay, you know what? There's some money in the bank over here, so let's get this mined out. And then silver. We'll get this picked up as well. Have we picked up the silver from out here? We totally have. Alright. And these rocks are still waiting to be hauled in here, I suppose, for some more stone blocks. Alrighty. Well... One step at a time. Let's actually put this a little bit fast forward now. Let it go into a little bit. Oh, we're still roofing this over. Yeah, so every time we make one of these, uh, we roof this over a bit more. Which is fine because, you know, it it's less liable of a drop in to happen. I could probably put some pillars over here to kind of keep that from happening completely. But at the same time, if there is a drop in right here, I gotta say that you're kind of fucked, right? You're like in the middle of all this shit. Now, in terms of um, blocks here, we're gonna need them. So we're going to have to start extending this dumping stockpile a bit more. I would say down to here, and then down to here. And you still are set up as the preferred one, right? Totally are. This right here is set up as normal, which is good. Okay. <clears throat> so we're going to start have to start finding some more rocks to haul off over here. Let me go into orders, and we'll do some hauling. Where at? Where from? Well, I guess they're kind of like the same like linked so we'll just have them haul some of these bad boys over they're already hauling too perfect good job guys alrighty and everybody has their room we're gonna probably have to mine this out a bit more to actually set one more extra room up in here but are we mining down here it seems like we are sweet we got some gold never messed around with gold before I'm not sure what it's for you detected an escape pod ooh hey um Nerhesi the ace now let's see Nerhesi um character wise 11 melee, 8 social, 7 medicine, 7 research. You're completely useless. I'm sorry, Nerhesi, but I'm going to have to harvest you for everything that you are worth. So, let's set this up as prison bed. It totally is already. You are building this, which is fine. Continue doing so. But the moment you are free, Biduero, which is now, I guess, uh, eating from Simple Meal. Camino, do me a favor. Before you eat from the Simple Meal, let's have you just come over and capture this individual. Alright. Sweet. And we have a few more turrets online. Let's make sure that you're connected to the uh, power source over here, huh? Now you're connected. Now you're connected. And what about you? Connected and... I gotta, I gotta do this before the raids actually land, because you know me. I won't do it and then when the, land, when the raid actually lands, I'm kinda like, oh! Wait a minute, why aren't they turning on? And it's like, like, well, Falcon, had you reconnected him earlier, we wouldn't be running into this issue now, right now, would we? God damn it, it was connected there. Alright, there we go. Now, all of you guys could just go offline, as you should be. What is this? Every colonist in the male gender winces in pain. Some distant engine of hatred is steering it. It's projecting a powerful psychic drone over this entire region. On a frequency that only seems to affect the male gender. For a few days, some people's moods would be quite a bit worse. That's unfortunate, but it is what it is. Alrighty, you guys still mining over here? Totally are. Alrighty, remember, we got a haul in mind too, guys. I want to see what this gold is all about. Now, I wonder what the... I guess you could... Can you just sell the gold? I guess you could probably make golden walls or something, right? Or golden floors? I wouldn't be surprised if you can. Let me... Just out of curiosity's sake here. Furniture. Yep, silver and gold furniture. <laughs> I guess, man. I'd just rather sell it. I mean, I'm not that... Luxurious, you know, I don't think we necessarily need that. Oh, by the way, we captured this person. Stop! Don't give them any sort of medicine, alright? They're gonna die soon, anyway. Prisoner, I mean, don't tell them that. Don't try to recruit. Doctor's care, sure, why not? Um, we will set this person up. Friendly Chad. Gets food. Don't even feed him, I mean. Well, I guess feed him for now so they don't die before we... Take their vital organs, obviously. He has cataracts, too, and a bad back and a concussion. Yeah, this guy is, you know, just off the bat. The moment he landed, he was just fucked. So let's take your left kidney, I'm gonna say. And let's find out. Like, usually they take their heart straight up, right? 
This makes me sound like some sort of morbid, morbid monster. I just usually take their hearts straight up. But I wonder if you take what piece by piece. Oh, see, that didn't kill him because it's just a kidney. Oh, just so we could harvest this dude one at a piece. All right, gotcha. The episode hasn't aired yet, I don't think, where I actually harvest people. So I know, I'm going to let you know right now, I'm going to probably get all these comments. Falcon, had you not taken to heart, you could have harvested this and that. So I'm talking to you now in the future, telling you I know what you're going to say in the past. No, I'm talking to you in the present now, once you see this video, and I'm talking to you about the past from the future. That hurts my head a lot. Never mind. Alrighty, so he's good to go. We we took that away from him. Now, we what else are we going to take from him? Well, let's find out. Right kidney? We're going to take a lung? No, I think a lung will kill him. Let's take a... No, let's not install anything on him. We have an issue right now. One second. Let's uh amputate his left eye? <laughs> sure. We'll amputate that as well. What do we have here? A group of tribes people from somewhere. They will prepare for a while and then attack. Alrighty, where are you guys at? Yeah, where are you guys at? You're over here. Are my people still over here working? They probably are. Okay. Uh, all hands on deck. You need to get out of there. You guys need to totally get out of there. So come over here. Hey, Tony. Tony, I I'm glad that you're trying to work right now, my friend. But it's not really the opportune time. Let's have you come over here. Alright, so everybody inside. Soon. Mental break soon by who? D-Money? D-Money, you're sleeping. Stop having mental breaks, right? Stop having nightmares. Stop being a little girly man. I'm done for today. Got malaria. God damn it. No, no, no. There's some medical facilities and there's a medical bed. So you go there. Good. Good idea. See, not smart. This guy got sick and he was like, fuck that. There's a medical bed over there. That's where I'm going. Good stuff, my friend. Uh, you guys, um, let me unrecruit you. I, I don't want you to go work. I want you to go get some rest. I'm good. Now, we're going to have some of these turrets unprotected, which is a problem, but I think that for the most part... Oh yeah, that's a small number of these dudes. Yeah, they have no chance, I would say. And if they do have a chance, then... Fuck, man, what I feel like the fool. So let's turn this all on right now. I don't even have to set my people up to give them backup, I don't think, right? You know what, I probably will, just because I like doing it. Oh, are we going to... Never mind, let's watch... Uh... Did you lose your eye already, too? Yeah. Oh, God. This poor individual. You landed in the wrong part of town, my friend. We have a heart over here. Not in a container, by the way. We have a kidney there. What happened to your eye? Oh, you can't harvest the eye. It's just body parts, literally. Like, inside organs. Ah, that's a shame. So we just basically tortured you for no reason. I get you. Alrighty, well, how about we, um... I'm sure taking the lungs gonna kill him, right? So, uh, two kidneys will kill you. You only need one. Um, everybody gets one. Let's do... Mm, we'll do harvest liver, I guess. That was gonna kill him. Let's take part of his lung. You know, for all we know, we'll need a lung sometime in life. Alright, so here they come, and... I don't think we need to set up our people for this. I think that the turrets should be able to do it by themselves. Let's actually just watch and watch it all happen. This guy's the smart one. He was like, yep, fuck that. I'm out of here. Alright, turrets. Don't let me down. Don't let me down, turrets. Turrets, please don't let me down. I'm gonna really lose a turret or two? That's really silly. Come on, turret. Well, now he's fucked. Alright, that one's dead now. He's actually knocked out. Uh, George, I'm not sure where you're going. Where do you think you're going? Can you stop, actually? And if you want to do something so bad, how about you just, uh, fire at this ombre over here? That guy's booking it. A lot of them are booking, as a matter of fact. So if we only lose one turret, I don't actually mind too much. I think that's actually a pretty good outcome overall. You shoot over here and then Tony S. Oh, Tony. Tony, Tony, where are you going? You're gonna go fix something. Well, actually, Tony, take a shot over here, my friend. You you are the birthday boy still, I believe, maybe? Alright, they're fleeing now. We have at least one knockout, two, three. I say three knockouts at the very least. And now they're done. So we only lost one turret. That's actually pretty good. I don't mind, uh... 160 off of that. Mind you, um, it's still not as great because they were just tribal people, so it really is making me wonder whether I should move these turrets back a bit because obviously this is a radius, meaning we could still get more bang for our buck moving them back. But I guess for now, we're going to roll this way. Might add one more layer of rocks up front just to impede them a bit more. We'll see. We'll definitely see. Um, and other than that, good um, raid, though. And then you guys could unrecruit. Wander about. 
Is this person dead yet? Not quite. You have been harvested, have you? Yeah, still waiting for that. That's gotta be a terrible operation table to be in right now. I'm just waiting to get, like, you know, my organs taken away as I'm alive to know that I'm gonna die. Now, Weaver, let's find out about this guy. <clears throat> Melee 6, uh, Construction 3, Growing 5, 3's, three 3's, Medicine 6, Crafting 8. I don't know, Till. I'm a little bit, um, iffy about you. We'll have to get back to you. Kanto! Named after the starting Pokemon region, apparently. Except with the K. Um, 6, 6, and 6, and 6. I actually prefer to keep this guy over Kanto, so Kanto's gonna probably get harvested right now. We also have Trobo. Trobo 3, 3, 5. Oh man, you guys are dog shit terrible, man. I'm sorry, Trobo, you're also gonna be harvested. So I guess we're gonna keep you. You somehow came through, told a weaver. Now, let's make sure you're not missing anything too important here. Right leg, you know, gunshots for the most part. Yeah, we could actually work with that. So, here is what we do. And we do it good. Let me go ahead and set this up as prisoner. So, um... We'll have us, first and foremost, rescue the guy that we want, right here. So, Jenna, you come and capture Toll. Mental break by D-Money. Why is that D-Money? What, what's your problem right now? Psychic drone, all right. Urgently hungry, well, you're eating now. Ate off the ground? You, you're sitting on the table right now, my friend, all right? Don't tell me you're eating off the ground, you liar. Don't you lie to me, liar. Uh, Jenna, where are you taking him? To the proper room. Excellent. Now, these guys, I don't really care where you take these guys because we're just going to harvest them anyway. So, let's see. Bidu Arrow, you come and capture Kanto. And then Wolverine, as soon as you're done over here. Eh, you don't even have to be done. D-Money, you come and capture Trobo. Kanto Trobo. Kind of like those names. Alrighty, so... That's all good. Now we pick up the dead bodies and all the meals involved, all the weaponry. Get these packaged survival meals out of the way. You know the routine. Clubs and fine meals as well. Alrighty, that seems to be all of them. And now we set up a structure, we'll... You know what? We have the stone blocks for it, right? Roughly. Let's actually do a stone door, maybe? See if it, you know, does anything different for us. I doubt it, but whatever. I have the stone for it right now, so I don't really mind too much. What is this? You have detected a cargo cluster somewhere. Ooh, silver. That I do like. Let's get this hauled off when we can, and we're still mining over here and doing our thing. Perfect. All right. So, uh, Trobo, before you get too many uh, meals fed to you, let's just set you up for operations here. We'll take away your... What happened to your right kidney? Amputate. Harvest liver, kidney, right lung, left lung, heart. Oh, you're missing a kidney already. Well, that's a problem. Is this your uh, lung? Oh, dude, you're still alive with only half a lung? Dude, you are a strong man. <laughs> this is like Dr. Frankenstein's table right here waiting to happen. Alrighty, dude, so... I think now we just take your liver, and that's about it. That's, that'll be all she wrote for him. Toll, you're the good one, right? Let's set you up for recruitment. Yo. Not get any medicine right now, because unfortunately we're a little bit low on medicine, but you'll get some doctor's care, you'll get some friendly chats, all the good nine yards there. Mine is medicine, that is. You need to be harvested for your last organ. Good, and then Kanto over here. Kanto, we'll keep you alive, so we have to feed you for sure. No friendly chat. Is he getting a friendly chat? Totally is, alrighty. Now you, on the other hand, will get operated for... Harvest, uh, right kidney, left kidney, so, so you do have kidneys, so I'll take your left one. Then this dude over here, we will take away his right lung. Alright. Morbid, but, you know, it has to happen. So, everything's all fine and dandy here. Are we also collecting the, uh, packaged meals, or are we just eating them? It seems like we're using them to feed them. I hate that, dude. There's actually a mod that allows you to make it so that they see the packaged survival meals as a secondary option, as opposed to always the first option, but... I had didn't grab it just because I'm an idiot. Local tortoise has gone mad. Oh no, be very careful. This tortoise is really, really fast. <laughs> Camino. Um, let me have you move around. I don't want you to get hurt by this tortoise. It seems kind of silly for that to happen. So let me have you move over here and just fire an arrow at its, I guess, proverbial knee. That's a good shot there. Uh-huh. Yep. Oh yeah, it's a really good shot. Who taught you how to shoot there, huh? A blind man? You know why? Because only a blind man would miss that bad. Come on, dude. Please land it. You are just busting my balls now, aren't you? 
Who gave you a bow? Did I give you a bow? You don't even deserve a bow. Uh, trade ship is passing nearby. They're a combat supplier. That's actually pretty good because we could probably get some good weapons now. I'm tired of these fucking bows. Dude, come on, land one, please. Okay, we got one. And... Uh-huh. Did this dude just block that shot or something with a shell? Alright, come on. Get it off and then run. Alrighty. Really, he's still not dead. That's really surprising. D-Money, do me a favor. Give me a hand here as well. Let's have you fire at Tortoise and then you fire at Tortoise. Alrighty? Come on, two people. Some of them you have to hit, right? This is really ridiculous. This is so disappointing. <laughs> Come on! He's so slow, how do you miss him? D-Money, you're about to get chomped on by this, um, turtle. Just an FYI. Fire, and then you fire here. Stop using up my medkits. I'm looking at my medkits right now. You guys are using them all up. Stop doing that. Come on, dude. I need to talk to a common supplier. This is fucking ridiculous at this point. Do I have to go in there and melee him? How are you? You're injured. Alrighty, guys. You guys are so fucking disappointing. <laughs> Come in. Just melee him, please. Maybe amongst all of you guys, you'll be okay. Fuck, finally. Uh, don't stop there. Just melee him to dead. Punch that dead turtle. You know, that turtle does actually have a little bit of extra protection. Every now and then, when you hit it, you see that spark? I think that's like some sort of, like, percent chance maybe they have of blocking damage. It's kind of weird. Kind of cool, though. Now, that's the armor that I want. This is really pathetic. It took you guys, like... You guys literally had to, like, gang mob that turtle to kill it. Get out of here. You guys are disappointing. Go do something important with your life. Alrighty, so this guy is completely dead now. Let's haul him off. Um, let's not burn any bodies just yet because I'm gonna probably have to strip him down. We harvested this dude's, um, organ. What else do we need here? We need a left lung, left kidney, liver. Yeah, so at this point, and the next thing we take away from him, we kill him. So we'll take his heart. And then this dude already lost his kidney. Let's go in here and add an operation for... Right kidney, right lung. Uh, well, might as well just take his heart. Okay. All good. And then this dude over here is um, set up for recruitment and everything, right? Prisoner? Yep. Okay. So, we're looking fine on that account. And then the trade ship passing nearby, we need to talk to them. Who is our smooth-talking individual here? Warden... Grecio! I wouldn't have it any other way. Grecio, come over here. And, um, talk to this Comet supplier. We might have some stuff that he's interested in, and we have a little bit of money for once, too. No medkits, unfortunately. No, they do. They do have. 22. Eh, kind of a little bit high price, but we kind of need it right now, so... You know what, motherfucker? You drive a hard bargain, but I'll oblige. And let me get at least, like, 30 of them for now, because I don't know when the... You know what? Let me just get all 31 that you have. I don't know when the next trade ship will pass by, anyway. So that's good, except that. Don't run off too far, good SEO. Alrighty, so. 32 medkits, I like it. Now. Now we make our money. And how are we gonna do this? Uh, pilas? Yeah, we could sell all those off. We don't need those. And short bows? Yeah, we've run our course with those. Short sword? We don't use melee, really. Cowboy hats? We have seven of them. Sell off. Oh, sell them all out. Deer hot cowboy hat. Actually, you know what? We still need to equip a few of our people with hats. So for now, let's... Well, you know, we could always make some more, right? Let's just sell the ones that we have. And if we need to make some more, we'll make some more. Sell that off. I have a heart that you might want to buy. But maybe the exotic goods dude will give me some more money for the parts, right? We'll see. One second. We'll, we'll figure it out. Tribal wear. Tortoise and Claude. Don't eat those. Uh, Devil strand. I will keep those because they're actually kind of decent compared to everything else. And Boomrad. Rhino hide. Okay. Frag grenades, I'm still gonna hold on to, just for mech reasons. And heart, synth thread I keep, hyperweave t-shirt I keep. Um, spear, eh, sell that off. Kidney, and then our prisoner is here. We could, you know, now that we've harvested them, we could, you know, sell them. But then, the thing is that if we sell them, the mental break could, you know, fuck our colony over. But this is like free money just to sell these people. Would it be really impactful if we sell it? Like, I don't want to, like, go into, like, a complete, like, mental break chain reaction where, like, you know, selling one of these dudes off is, like, the end of the world. Um, Leon Field, they have an M16. We might want to get one of these M16s, honestly. Or we might just want to make our own later on. Pistol. Mm, one Leon Field. 
Let me get at least, like, two pistols off of you. Or three. Just because I'm tired of, like, rocking those bows already. So get three of those off of you. And then you have a few slaves as well. Who do you have here? Who are you? An eagle, the herbalist, melee seven, shooting five, growing seven, medicine seven. Not too crazy about him. Uh, Ivel, the barkeep. Not too crazy about him either. Slowpoke as well. Yeah. I feel like we're getting a lot of Pokemon references here recently. What about you? Inigo Jones, uh, Medicine 7, Melee 7, Shooting 5. He's volatile, meaning mental. Oh, he has a... You know what? Let's get Inigo Jones. Can we afford you? I hope. Trader has no more. What do you mean he has no? Oh, I just wanted one. Alrighty, and we have Inigo, and we still have 679, and we have medkits, so yeah, I'm actually pretty happy with that. We got some pistols out of it, too. So, Inigo, welcome to the colony. Do we have a bed for you? I hope we do, but I'm not completely sure. You'll probably take one of these beds for now, won't you? No? We well, might have a bed for you, I don't know. I don't know where, sure where the hell you're at. But we'll find out soon. Now, Inigo, let me give you a pistol. And are you running around naked? You probably are. Yep, let me give you the Devil Strand Tribal Wear. Good. Good stuff. And that's about it for now. Now let's find out who is lacking a pistol at the very least, because these bows are out of control. Gressio doesn't fight. You could use a pistol. Sequence less of a great bow, so I'm gonna have you hold on to that. D-Money and your cohort here who couldn't even hit a turtle. You guys probably need guns, because your guys are terrible at that. Uh, Biduero. Camino. Alrighty, let's go and give this to... I guess Dacry, just because he failed me a lot less with that last exchange there with the turtle. So shooting five. Darkrai, Dacry, you come and grab this pistol. You're good to go now. Excellent. Alrighty. Colin is needs treatment. I'm done for today. He needs treatment. Well, get get in bed, bro. Get your ass in bed. Alrighty. So, that's looking good here. And these guys have been harvested completely. Let's uh get them out of here. Would have loved selling them, but again, I was worried about the mental break. So, uh, what about what about these kidneys and hearts? Where, why aren't we moving them over here anymore? I guess we're hauling more important stuff. All right, D Money, try to get him to join. You know, you guys are wearing the same outfit anyway, right? Told the Weaver, how are your thoughts coming along here? You're going up. Witness allies dead. Well, that's gonna happen. Cramped environment in prison. Pleasant environment. Oh, he's got a pleasant environment at least. Oh, he's coming along. I'm done for today. He's getting some medical treatment. Excellent. We still need to haul some of this stuff up over here, too. Mm, and bodies need to be burned kind of soon. Sequence life. Let me have you just really quickly strip all these dudes out. And this guy. One of these people had regular clothes on. I'm kind of surprised. Alrighty. All good. Now, we're almost done cleaning up here. A few more bodies to pick up. Excellent, and then a few more weapons here. If we could actually get these weapons picked up, we could sell them before that um, trade ship leaves. However, it's all up to these guys actually doing that. You don't haul. That's quite disappointing. Are we hauling from here instead? Yeah, that's where we're hauling for now. Okay, well, fuck me, I guess. I was calling an episode here, guys. I think we did uh, some pretty good stuff here. We got some money finally, and we have medkits up and running again, and we're going to continue expanding this base. We're going to mess around with gold as well and see who could buy our gold off so we can get some more money. Trading gold for silver. It's really awkward. Either way, hopefully you guys enjoyed the episode. If you did, I encourage you to leave a thumbs up, leave a like. The support always does mean a lot, and I probably have a few renames to do right now, so um, expect new names next episode. I will catch you next time.